Welcome back, everybody. Level one, microwave, boots, drifts, red eye, Ripner, <laughs> visceral. Good to see you, Captain <laughs> Anonymous. <laughs> Welcome. Good to see you, Lanyu. Doing well. Doing well. Good to see you, everybody. Up. Oh. Crimson Horror offering to uh, help us all become famous. Awesome. <laughs> Let me just tidy that up real quick. <laughs> uh, let's see. Just get rid of this one here. We'll go ahead and. Uh, uh, how's everybody doing? There we go. Let's see. Excited for the update? Yeah, I am, Visceral. You know, I, uh... <laughs> they made a big deal online, War Thunder did, about adding napalm. And, like, in their... In the video, like, advertising it, they just showed <laughs> the napalming of a village. <laughs> like... Oh, man. Smobird with the uh, Prime subscription. Two months now. Give the puppers a pat. Will will do, Smobird. Thanks uh, thanks so much for the uh, support. Smoboard, rather. Excuse me. Thanks so much for the, uh, for the support. Yeah, so they, you know, they're like, we're adding napalm to a game that doesn't involve infantry combat. And, you know, I mean, sure, there will be some some burning you know function to the tanks and stuff but it's just man I, I don't i don't know i don't know um law my thoughts on the f-14 i i did a video about it um over on the uh, the main youtube channel it you know it was fine like it was clear that they were kind of troubleshooting some missile gameplay like even in flies uh, fly daily's first video with the f-14 he was struggling with the missiles um, on the test flight, and I was able to get them to work, um, but he wasn't, and it seems like they're kind of still tweaking some things with that. Um, oh man, we got another one. My gosh, hang on. Obviously ignore all the, uh, the weird, weird stuff we got here. Uh, hang on, we'll go ahead and manage and restrict. Boom. There we go. Um... Yeah, Nodak, <laughs> Nodak Overfly. Not in terms of, uh, like, actual, you know, quality gameplay. <laughs> That's okay, though. But but the point is, like, Fly's, Fly's issue was very much real there. Like, it was, it, it's weird sorting out how the phoenixes work, uh, you know. Um, and so, I'll be interested to see how it goes. It's a big plane. It is very fast. You could see it in one of my, uh, in, in one of the videos that I did about it. Like, I passed an F-4 Phantom like it was standing still. And I had, like, a, a full loadout of missiles. And, um, man, it just just blew right past that thing. Here, I'll just jump into a match here while we chat. And um, it's, uh, man, it, it's, it's fun, no doubt. Um, I, I don't think it's going to be for me. I haven't seen any, um, like, opportunities to just buy it. It doesn't look like there's a pack for it or a premium, which is odd, right? Given that, uh, let's see what do I want. I want the, the greater pen. Um, it's it's odd that, you know, it's Top Gun's out and this thing has, uh, you know, there's so much opportunity that for them just to sell this thing. And they're like, nope, it's, uh, it's an 11.3 and you got to grind for it. Good luck. You know, like, really? Um, so whatever. We'll see. Uh, Coley, good to see you. Yeah, super face plant, absolutely. <laughs> yeah, Captain Anonymous, that's that's what I was thinking. You know, if that... Ooh, that's a little loud for me. Let me turn that down just a bit here. Um, if that's the early F-14 that they've got in the game, you know, what what is it going to look like? Sorry about the windows noise there. What is, what is, what is the, like, the B and subsequent models going to look like? They're going to have way better engines um it, it's gonna be crazy um so i just i don't know um yeah you're, you're exactly right visceral uh napalm could be against uh yeah it, it would it it will be able to damage tanks no doubt there but 
and it was just such a such a weird thing. They're like, we're proud to announce, you know, right after, <laughs> you know, the ongoing situation in Ukraine and kind of some weirdness with an unfortunate school shooting in Texas and whatnot, that you now have the ability to barbecue people in War Thunder. I'm like, really? <laughs> I don't know. It uh, it hit weird. It hit weird. There we go. Some good, some. Oh, come on now. Yeah, I was thinking that too, Robin. They may sell later versions. Oh, jeez. Uh oh. Target engaged. Wait, wait. Target identified. Come on. Thank you. Excuse me. We'll get that thing yet. Nope, somebody else got it. Good. Whew. <laughs> you got to get to rank five or so so you can grind. Man, I'm sorry. That is loud. I'm going to turn this down a little bit more. There we go. Uh, so you can grind the F-14? Yeah. No, I, I, I don't know. I'll be interested to see what they do with it. What I'm really excited about with this upcoming update, though, is that they are adding... Like a 10.3 U.S. tank that can be, oh man, um, that can be researched as a squad vehicle or just purchased for Golden Eagles, and um, that I'm excited about because the highest, the highest tank on the American tree that you can just downright, you know, Golden Eagle scum your way to is uh, is an 8.0 right now and that's what i'm that's what i'm rocking most of the time and it's a good tank make no mistake but it's not ideal Our victory is near. oh come on now there we go shoot through this thing lengthwise after it beached itself i have really like i can't I can't tell you how weird it was for me today when I'm like, what do I want to stream? And I'm like, oh, you know, could do Grand Theft Auto again, could do some other kind of games that I've just got out there, could do Valkyria Chronicles. I, I rolled credits on Valkyria Chronicles, so I've, I've got post-game stuff that I could stream for that. And I was like, no, you know, I want to play War Thunder. And like, who, who even am I at this point, you know? <laughs> I don't do that these days. Dangerous healing. Oh gosh, all right. Eight. Oh, oh no, no, we just capsized. Uh, oh, I thought we were bringing it around. My bad, my bad. Uh, yeah. Yeah, the free Abrams, uh, let's see here. Yeah, it's M M1A2 AIM, I believe. There we go. Squiddo, good to see you. Yeah, drifting a destroyer did not go well for us. I saw that bad guy like a lot closer than I thought he should be and just kind of botched it to be Oh, let's hit. Let's see those hits. Boom. All right. Love it. We got some, we got some rounds with some pen here. This ship in particular, whoa, there just went all of their command. Farewell. I enjoy naval in this game. You know, I mentioned it in a video. I think of War Thunder more uh, in terms of uh, in terms of the ground battles than I do the air battles. But uh, I guess it actually started out in with air battles. I didn't. I did not realize that. I was definitely. I was not playing it back then. So, fighter jet enthusiast with the Prime subscription, three months now. Thanks so much, fighter jet. Good to see you. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, heli attack. Do I have interest in VTOL VR? I do. Uh, I'm not sure if it's playable not in VR. Um, I, I can't do VR. Uh, VR very much makes me sick. And so uh, if they have like a VTOL VR version that is, you know, playable not in VR, then I am there. Absolutely. Microwave, is it worth spending your life savings on DCS World? <laughs> You know, it's fun to, like, learn about some of those planes and that sort of thing, but, uh, 
Unless you're really interested in, like, making your own fun with, like, setting up campaigns. Oh, man, we got target danger close. Hang on, we gotta make sure these count. We got, we got one shot at this. Boom. By golly. Snuck up on us right there. C4, good to see you. Fighter jet? No worries, I have been too, so n no problem. Um, but no, microwave, you know, if you don't, uh... If, if you, like, want to just be able to turn on a game and just have fun with it, more than just going out and, like, flying a quick mission, DCS is not going to do that for you. You might be able to do some dogfights in multiplayer servers or something like that, assuming that you get into those, because they, be, they can be tough. But, uh, you know, DCS is really cool, and it is very fun um, if you take the time to learn the systems and everything and that that is that is a huge time commitment all right well those guys are gonna get b so i'm gonna go up here and start working my way around this island dangerous listing can we capsize the boat 3k 50s <laughs> uh, should get a pilot's license there you go microwave yeah i mean if it's down to a pilot's license or DCS, definitely get the pilot's license. <laughs> oh, come on. There we go. All right. Let's see. I think they kind of got rocked here. The Sumner is awesome. Face plant. This ship is great. Um, will we clear it? Oh, you know what? That's just, that's just, uh, some cosmetic damage. Some cosmetic damage from a little love tap there. <laughs> Sunscriber. <laughs> Good to see you. Welcome. There we go. Johnny Depp versus the Amber Heard thing. I know nothing about it, um, but, you know, it's been interesting to see how much attention it's gotten. I mean, uh, either way, it sounds like it was a bad situation all around. You can get a pilot's license around 13 where you are, uh, level one. That is awesome. I mean, provided that you've, you know, got the, the resources and, you know, the, the money to do that sort of thing. By golly, Gaps, absolutely go for it. Um, let's see. I'm trying to get the Fletcher. Trying to get the Fletcher fully upgraded. Um, that's my most recent um, upgrade there. So I'm just working on working on grinding out its uh, modifications and that sort of thing. Yeah, get your pilot's license. Ten out of ten would recommend. Yep, yeah, absolutely. It is a freeing sort of thing. Provided that you have the money <laughs> to be able to go fly, um, you know, with any frequency or, you know, as part of a job or something like that. Because it is expensive. Let's see. Healthy tea. Good to see you. Thanks for stopping by. Let's see. <laughs> Captain, yeah, that's true. You don't have to worry about the horrible passers. You know, if you're if you're flying, you don't have to worry about horrible drivers passing you at 150 miles an hour or or breaking in front of you when you're towing a five-ton bobcat. That is valid. Oh boy, I'll bring this in a little bit. We'll go quite a bit more. Boom. And switch the ammo. I find that I routinely forget that guy's shooting at me. You better stop it. You stop it. Ooh. Yikes. I'll get more guns on target. I don't mind. Oh, level one. I've done some flying up there. Good stuff. Let's see here. Oh, shoot. 
This ship is just determined to shoot at me, and I do not wish to engage. But, I mean, I'm going to if I need to. Jeez. <laughs> there we go. I'm just going to cancel the maintenance part until the fire gets put out here. There we go. Now we can get back to all the other stuff. All the other fixes. Enemy forces have captured a zone. All right, and we can start fixing. There we go. A race type event would be fun. Law, yeah. We did one where it was just kind of like follow the leader, or like tag more or less in airplanes. That was a pretty good time. My schedule has not been conducive to community events, and even the community event that we did for 200,000 subscribers, I, like, lost the video of, uh, like, I, I, I can't even finish making the, wow, I can't believe we got hits on that, the, uh, the compilation. Because I just, I don't have the video anymore, so, whoops. Oh, good. Another fire. Awesome. There we go. There's some hits. And some more hits. Awesome. Dangerous. Dangerous core. Oh, boy. Started to turn the wrong way. We saved it. Yeah, I have really enjoyed the uh, community events that we've done, um, but, you know, it's just, it's, the, the, my, my schedule doesn't really work with it very often. And unfortunately, why, hello there. The enemy's getting closer to victory. Oh, boy. There's almost always somebody who's just, like, screaming into the microphone or something, you know. I've just got to be a little bit better about the administration of the thing. What am I hearing? Is that ship shooting rockets? I think he was shooting rockets. Yeah, it must be 17 to obtain a license. Unless there's like some weird, you know, consent for that your parents can sign or something like that. That's. 17 is the number I normally think about. Wow, we got hits on that. That's awesome. Okay, we got ships out everywhere. Yeah, that's where the napalm comes in. Oh, yeah, there he is launching stuff. That is a truly hideous noise. I wish that I could just mute the sound from that particular weapon system. <laughs> Ugh. Understand what the numbers like. What are hap? What what is happening? There we go. I'm gonna push this little ship right through the spawn, <laughs> right through the cap point. Ah, things are different in Montana. Don't don't worry about it. Level one, they just <laughs> they make up their own rules up there. Now. Who are we supposed to attack? Somebody out there? I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. What is our... Oh, okay. All right. Our extremely effective anti-aircraft people are shooting directly into the mountain. Love it. You'll love to see it. <laughs> 
Yeah, level one. Yep. Absolutely. <laughs> Oops, he's not he is not closing on me. We're ahead of the enemy. Whew. Saw that. You better start actually moving. Perfect. No one will expect Oh, PT boat. Come on now. Come on now. I <laughs> got his engine. And... Oh, no. We missed him. Get him this time. Can we take out the PG boat with the torpedo? We can hope. We can hope. Boy, that was snug. One point something and change. We don't have to lead too much on those. Oh, good. I mean, particularly when he's sitting still. Awesome. Take him down. Looks like we might be driving directly at another ship also. Oh, I sank that one. Good. And that PT goat that was back behind me there. Uh. <laughs> Lots of good kills happening here. This is good. All right. Excuse me? Is it you? I oh, know you didn't. <laughs> That was the one I damaged. He hid, repaired, tried to engage me again, got immediately exploded. All right. There we go. I do like this ship. There's no, there's no denying that as evidenced by the things that are happening here in this battle. All right. Go. Try and go back of the boat here. Back of the boat. We had one wildly missed there. I don't know what happened. This thing is just it's just constantly burning. Can we get can we get a a fatality here? Three percent crew. Alright, we gotta focus on somebody else. Boom, there we go. This is a good spot. Here in a oh. <laughs> oh, he missed somehow there. I don't know. I don't even understand exactly what happened. All right, we, we'll go towards the back of the boat here. All right. I don't feel good about spawn camping them. I don't want to be in here. We'll head back. Okay. Where are you even at? Just four kills? Is that all we're at? If you're gonna... Oh, that, that person's not even shooting at me, though. This person, though. This person's... There we go. That's the range. Just a little bit lower for that ammo. Only 36... 33% crew left on us at this point, unfortunately. There you go. Knocked out something important there. Awful lot of their ships turning red. Oh, what's going on? There we go. I'd love to knock out the effectiveness of those guns. It's all right. We 
was dropping something. I don't even know what they were. I would say depth charges, but that doesn't make sense. Maybe cranking some torpedoes out at us. No, they definitely, definitely dropped something. Uh-oh. Not enough free crew. Somebody get some shots on target here. What's happened? Oh, wait, let's see if we can roll another one. Yeah, we're rolling another one. <laughs> I refuse. Refuse to get, <laughs> to just give up. <laughs> oh man, yeah, even the misses look spectacular when they thread the needle. Yeah, absolutely. We had a few of those. Uh, Legend Defender, good to see you. Welcome. Um, uh, let's see. Oh, we got something else. Okay, we got to go sort out some more research here. Bomb mortar, torpedoes, maintenance, and then the rest of it hopefully goes. Yeah, so what is that 1377 go somewhere? Hmm? Does that go towards the next ship? What are we at here? Yeah, not quite. Yeah, the sum the Sumner is incredible. Uh, the Mitcher was pretty good as well. I think I've got that one fully done. Oh no, I don't. I need to. Man, what am I? What am I even doing? We gotta get. Uh, Get this thing back out there. I forget what the details were on that thing, but that's okay. Sunscriber? Nope, they are asleep. And I am jealous. <laughs> ah. Let's see. Wow, Smobird, you were flying today and you flew into an airport and there was an F-4 Phantom just sitting on the ramp. A lot of abandoned fighter jets. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In California. Absolutely. A whole lot of them out there. 40 head of cattle. Captain, that's awesome. Are they dairy cattle then? Or, I mean... Uh, you guys just have them for like grazing purposes or what? It's 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 actually interesting. There's a whole um like cattle wrangling from helicopters is really quite common in uh, Australia. I I don't I don't even know. Ah, commercially breed. Gotcha, captain. But yeah, I just it's pretty incredible to see uh, some of those, some of those pilots. Yeah, we'll go with that. That's fine. Um, to see those those pilots like herding cattle with like a, a a real small helicopter, just incredible. I forget what they normally fly. Yeah. Uh, raise two to slaughter weight each year and then take them to livestock shows? Yeah, absolutely. Let's see. I forget even what, like, the cannon function is on this. Ah, fast. Okay, got it. Uh, excuse me. If you could start turning, I would appreciate it. Excuse me. I'll just start gently coaxing them off to the right. I am a sunscriber. I am a, when when I drink beverages of the adult nature, it's a light beer for me. Just nothing fancy. I got a hit from something. That was incredible. I really don't want to go out this way. So if you guys could stop kind of like hurting me out here. You see, I kind of want to stay close to the islands, okay? And I mean, I'm going to outrun you eventually, but until then, if you could start turning just a little, I would appreciate it. There we go. <laughs> Yeah, 
I spent- Oh boy, alright. See? See, this is what happens. And then you guys are all like, oh no, yeah, see, man. Alright, these two ships. These two ships are kind of idiots back here. And you know what? I am just gonna try and get the heck out of your way, and you're gonna deal with that right there. And I feel bad about it a little bit, but not that bad about it. Guys, this is ridiculous. I'm so sick of you guys. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna I'm gonna go out and around. This is gonna give me a good opportunity to uncork some torpedoes. Oh nope, they, they disabled the torpedo tube like the second I was turning. Incredible. Getting fast. Got his motors, though. Cover me. Oh, hang on. Seven to cancel. We are We're gonna keep losing as long as our idiots keep pushing way out to the west. This is ridiculous. This is terrible. Oh my gosh, you guys. You gotta go towards the center. <laughs> Ridiculous! Ah, man. Let's see here. Alright, I'm not going up there again. Those people? No, I'm not doing it. I'm going over this way. Gunners are searching for airborne and surface targets. Ah. Aviation YouTubers do I watch? Mm, the corporate pilot dad from time to time. Um, I see some of, uh, 74 Gears videos, but, I mean, most of his, I mean, not most, but a lot of his stuff is, like, pilots versus ATC, and, like, I, I don't really like that messaging myself, so I, I don't watch a whole lot of his stuff. There we go, a couple hits. There we go. Boom, there we go. <laughs> that one 1028 guy with the uh, subscription nine months now <laughs> a whole baby <laughs> that's awesome 1028 thanks so much for the support I appreciate it and our our gunners over here are not messing around the ship is not even looking at me yet. That he will be after this one. No, oh, he's sitting still. All right. There we go. If we I like how the little target reticle thing, the little red carrot, kind of directly under the distance to that ship is like, just aim right at him. Like you're not, you're not accounting for my movement, you know. Gotta, gotta take into account that we are also moving. Boom! There we go. Good hits. He's starting to move now. Good. Ooh. There we go. There we go. That knocked out some stuff. Hey, you good. You good and retreat if you think you can. I said confidently, well, he's probably going to end up sinking me somehow. This is good. We're going to get the back guns around on him here in just a second. There we go. There we go. All right. What is happening here? Is this seriously a bad guy just rolling into dodge? <laughs> yeah, just chucking torpedoes. 
Look at that. <laughs> I didn't think we could get... Nope, yeah, accidentally shot our friendly right there. Ooh! Friendly just by the farm to some of those torpedoes. Slappins McCoy applied to be a 911 dispatcher. Man, good, good luck. That is a tough job. Good luck. We need, we need people who are excited to do that sort of thing, no doubt. Oh, somebody help me with the repair. Boom. <laughs> oh, man. This game is very fun when you have the bigger ship and the better crew. Hear the bomb. All right. Why, hello there. Less than a mile away. Four shots per head. Oh, man. <laughs> That's what... Gosh, I love this. You're just... Just ripping through their crew here. We should probably... Let's just... Let's mix it up to a different round here just to let them have it. There we go. Allied forces have captured a zone. Was that the point that I was just on? Basically, but not entirely. Dangerously low on course. Uh oh. Oh, that now nah, we'll be fine. Woo! Keep them sinking. Somebody, somebody says we need the B point. I'm on it. All right. See, in this, you know, I mentioned it at, at one point. Um, but like one of the reasons that Naval has been hitting the spot for me so much is, oh man. I've been just trying to grind convertible RP for, like, my, uh, being able to upgrade, like, my, um, tanks with, uh, with Golden Eagles, and, man, I get so many more points in naval battles than I do on anything else. It's just, it's not even close. Blurg, good to see you. Oh, oh, let's see what's happening. Ah, yes, hello there. I missed him, but he's down there somewhere. Yep. Better come stop me. My One of my machine gunners is looking directly at that guy. guys are very interested in my location. Why don't you deal with the USS Barker, okay? Hello there. Whoa. We'll get another shot on target. There we go. <laughs> Can we thread the needle? It's gonna be close. Yeah, I saw you guys mention about, uh, you know, Chevys and that sort of thing. I've, I've had Chevys, I've had Forge, and I've had, uh, Dodges. I like it. I'm not picky when it comes to vehicles. My favorite brand is paid for. <laughs> whatever, whatever is paid for, I'm happy with. Are they decapping? No, we're capping A. Oh, good. We got some we got some troublemakers out here. I got this. Oh, no, alright. <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on. Ah, oh, alright. This thing has some Good reverse action here, I tell you what. Is that a ship? Nope. We'll sit here and focus on focus on planes, I guess, for a while. Kill assist. Ooh. 
A Jeep with an inline six. Nice. 24 second, zero to 60 speed. <laughs> you know what? That's just fine. <laughs> oh wow. I can't I can't believe we got a target destroyed on that. I mean we weren't even close to the top damager. We'll give you the opportunity to run, should you so choose. If you come out here to get me. It's just incredible how fast this this ship shoots. The enemy ship sank. There you go. Dang. Six and a plane. Come on now. Let's get some distance adjustment here, please. What is happening? Got something. Oh. Boom. <laughs> right over that rock. And that was, oh boy. Doing some damage to nature out here. coming in for us. They're getting sick of my shenanigans. Uh-oh. This KR, sorry. Might have peppered, might have peppered my buddy. Oh, oh we got, <laughs> we got the ship and the, uh, and the plane. They're credited with both right there. Whoop. <laughs> oh man, instantly on fire. That that is what the Sumner does. <laughs> Jeez. I would like to say that this is all just, you know, mad skill or something, but nah, nah. Uh oh. Knocked out a couple of our guns. And I took that personally. Oh, come on now. Happening with our range here. What do we need to do. We need to go ahead and just keep on cranking it around. We got any other ships out here messing with us? Nope. There we go. Now we got now we got all the guns on target here. Aircraft is, we got another plane down. <laughs> Just a carcass. We're good. All right, we'll work on some repairs while we do this. Hope everybody's having a great evening. Somebody him. Just another plane here. 
Too bad I didn't have like a uh, booster or something for this, you know. Eight ships and three planes. So what's the uh Oh, I see you. I see you. Wow. Here it is. We got this. We got time. Oh, dang. <laughs> ah, shoot. That's all right. Discussion of vehicles here, huh? Interesting. Trucks for 600 mile journeys. I don't even like riding in a truck that long. Or a, a vehicle for that long, I should say. A naval blitz mobile game like this, but it's one life and only eliminations. Hmm. Aircraft carriers, light battleships, medium battleships. Huh. Interesting. Sunscriber, that's pretty cool. All right. Keep this going. Now, Captain, are you talking about when you when you say truck, are you talking about um like a like a pickup or are you talking like an eighteen wheeler tractor trailer setup? Ah, gotcha. F three fifty, very nice. Oops. Bump the microphone there, sorry about that. Uh Mace Keeks, welcome. Welcome to the stream. Hope everybody's having a great evening here. Ugh. Let's see. Hmm. <laughs> the sum the Sumner is just cheating sometimes, so we'll use this one. Gunners are searching for airborne and surface targets. Battle of Warships Naval Naval Blitz, huh? Sunscriber, I'll have to check that out. Did anybody end up playing the um, Diablo mobile game that just came out? Uh, I forget what it was called when it finally came out, but there was like uproar when the next Diablo was going to be a mobile game. And <laughs> oh wow! All right, my gunners are already like, we got this, boss. Don't worry. I'm like, are you guys sure? Jeez, this map, we are close. We are already close. Where are you going? I did not play that Diablo mobile game, but I, I heard that it was uh, really quite toxic with its microtransactions and that sort of thing. Unfortunately, to be expected, I think. Jeez. Oh, we're missing him. Missing him in front. There we go. Level one sounds great. Thank you. Oh, I see you. I see you. You just sit still right there. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about what's happening. Oh, you started to worry about what was happening. Disappointing. There's a lot of hostile, hostile camouflage ships in this particular map. We got some sort of recon boat. Oh man, it's got good evasive maneuvers too. There we got him. Oh, there's 
there's at least one over there. Okay, friendly, friendly heading in. Hello there. Kind of walk the fire down the ship to keep knocking out their systems. Just keep high, you know, hammering rounds into the same the place. Here we go. The enemy ship sank. It doesn't really help, you know. I already destroyed those parts of their ship. Is that one really? No. Okay. Whew. Capping this? No, we are decapping again. Well, looks like our person is not down there anymore, so I don't know how much we're actually decapping, but at least that was the idea. Oh, this is his turning. He's turning to shoot at me. Oh, we got something big. Something big blown up up there. Oh, oh, man. That was the Sumner. Oh, there's another one. That's the ship that I was destroying everybody with last game. Getting good hits. Man, we've done we have done a number on that ship right there. Is that thing still alive? Is that is that a real bad guy ship right there? Yeah, it was. Farewell. Good. All right. Well, perfect. Weather master, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Did you know, you know, speaking of weather master, that most air traffic controllers who work in towers become NOAA certified weather observers? <laughs> a weird a weird side perk of having been an air traffic controller who worked in a tower was like becoming a like a certified weather observer <laughs> yeah oh, oh. danger close hang on uh, i don't even have a gun who can get on target there we go all right <laughs> Got a little oil slick right there and everything that's really cool I had anything to do with the hits that guy had. Is this a plane? Yeah, it is. Ooh! <laughs> I had nothing to do with that, but that was pretty awesome. I'm just gonna drive around in reverse at this point. We got this, we got this, we got this. But we missed it. All right. They came in a little too hot. Let's 
Slappins with the Honda Fit, huh? I can't even envision that. Is that like a little, like a, uh, like a hatchback? Boots Drifts, uh, been lurking and playing Forza. No problem at all. I enjoy the Forza games. Probably the, the next, like, real, realistic simmy one that they do. I'll probably do some, some streams of it from time to time. I don't really do the, uh, the, well, the, the non sim whoa. How do we not get a, a terrain warning when we're going in reverse, hmm? We need that. How would I rate my War Thunder experience? Oh, man. Complicated. <laughs> you know, the fact that it's been hitting the spot, you know, that I've been enjoying playing it again recently is great, but it's been a long time since that has happened, so... <laughs> no, I'm... I'm enjoying it. Let's see here. This will head out to B. This will go Cat B. People, oh, they only have two. They only have two ships left. Okay. These guys got kind of stomped. Is that a Stuka? Bring it in the Stuka. Three miles out. Boom. Are you serious? Keep turning. All right. This is probably not. We're probably not gonna make it out of this one. That's all right. I only got two ships left. I don't even feel that bad about it. Uh, no, all right. We're good. Hey, uh... There we go. See, the trick when you get beached is to just slam it in reverse before the ship really settles on the beach. Like, as soon as you realize that you're stuck going into the sand... Give it, give it more speed, if anything, and then slam it in reverse once you actually make contact. Oh, okay, that was not... That was my gunners, not me. There we go. Hey! Ah, goodness. Yeah, that's, that's exactly right. Pin it before you stop. That's right, Boots. You got it. <laughs> Slappins, there was an allied ship trapped behind lines that escaped by disguising itself as an island. <laughs> That's awesome. Where's my island camouflage, hmm? This is what I want. Maybe we should try some coastal here. I mean, I feel, I, I enjoy, make no mistake, love wrecking shop with the, uh, the Sumner and whatnot, but we could always... I mean, we're, we're doing it. We're going, we'll get, uh, we'll get this group. There we go. Let's see. And maybe I need to, I need to get Michener out of here. I mean, we'll probably get it with, ooh, the Carmi. There's some fancy looking boats out here. Just send that crew to holiday so we only have the one. So we need 2,900 points. 2,900 points from our two torpedoes that can only be shot directly forward, mind you. And two 50 caliber machine guns. We're doing it. RC Cola. Oh, man. That takes me bad. <laughs> Back. <laughs> Haven't thought about RC Cola in... Oof. Goodness gracious. Sorry about that. Keep bumping the mic stand. Um, I haven't thought about RC Cola in years. Um, <laughs> no, no specific thoughts, I guess. Um, what was, what was it that we used to drink? There was some brand, and it definitely wasn't RC, but it was some, some like off-brand. Like, you could get grape soda and strawberry soda and that sort of thing. And, and I, I remember that from when I was a kid. But, uh, excuse me. 
but I can't uh, I can't remember what it was so berries and cream RC Cola huh interesting the dollar store huh or Dollar Tree had no idea well We'll see how long this goes for us here. We'll give it we'll give it until two. Uh Fanta is a good one, undoubtedly, but no, it was not it was not nearly as high brow as Fanta that I was thinking of. I do like Fanta though from time to time. Is it? Is that a is that an old soda at this point? Sunscriber? Fanta is? Man, I remember like Fanta TV commercials. I feel like in the 2000s that were like, don't you wanna wanna Fanta? Don't you wanna? That wasn't, I mean, I, in my mind, that wasn't that long ago, but that might have been a really long time ago. I don't really know. <laughs> RC Cola tastes better than Coke and Pepsi uh, boots. Interesting. Oh, I'm not I'm not that familiar. Yeah, okay. Thanks, Canned. I appreciate it. <laughs> I, was, I was losing it there for a second. Microwave. <laughs> You're just freaking us out with the fact that our body might suddenly eat our eyes again. That's, that's always... That always uh, ins ensures that we're going to sleep well. That's great. I appreciate that. <laughs> Like, well, um, like, well, I don't know. Let's see here. Generally, if I hit cancel, I end up getting, you know, launched into a match. So, nope, not that time. What, what does this thing even have? Let's see. Oh, couple couple sets of machine guns that'll be something just try and get back out there yeah th thanks but thanks for the reminder microwave appreciate it <laughs> uh, just one one person waiting for battle at this point sad face miso mix huh sunscriber no nope, doesn't doesn't ring a bell with me Let's see, what are we even at? Oops. Hmm. Yeah, exactly canned. That's exactly right. It waits until you don't want to anymore and then it throws you in against your will. It's true. Fanta was made in the 80s. Okay, all right. Shasta, yeah, Shasta. I mean, that could, it could have been Shasta. I don't remember. I don't remember when Shasta came around. But uh, yeah, Shasta. Shasta does have good, good strawberry soda. They make. You can do a really good um, float with strawberry Shasta. Mix in some uh, some vanilla ice cream. Pretty good. Pretty good stuff. Oh, yes, I, I did know that microwave. <laughs> did, did you know that a, a large portion of people who have to get intubated end up having their front teeth broken off? <laughs> intubation. Intubation is no joke. That's, uh, it happens. <laughs> Null is a good boy, gifting a uh, tier one sub, and congratulations to Canned Party. Thank you very much, Null. <laughs> awesome. I appreciate it. Good to see you. <laughs> All right, we're gonna have to give up on this. We're not having any luck. I mean, maybe, maybe we. I don't. I don't even. Why don't even want to switch to an arcade battles here? Let's see here. We'll just. Uh, ooh. Should we should we start working out some of these other ships? Oh, we got a 5.0. I didn't even realize that. All right. 
Yeah, that's fine. And we'll go, uh, what do we, what, what else? Nope, Sumner we got, we'll take out, we'll take out the Barker. We'll put the, the 3.3. Nah, I won't, I won't do that. I won't do that with the 3.3. We'll take the, uh, the Fletcher out as well there. Yeah, that's, that's exactly right, microwave. Okay, so what is, what is this thing? Oh, interesting. I don't think I've used this at all. Yeah, no, nope, literally, literally not used this thing at all. 5.0 though, I mean, with a, with a big enough up tier, we could start wandering into, uh, battleship territory. Hmm, okay. Well, we'll see what happens. <laughs> no, it's a good thing you're not here because you'd be destroying me right now with the uh <laughs> in game. I had a couple good matches here. It was nice. Felt felt good. I might have to make a YouTube video about that one where I had like eight ship kills. <laughs> oh boy, we're not gonna have the ability to repair or anything here. We are gonna we're just gonna Blast right in there. Searching for airborne and surface targets. Oh boy. Where are we going? Target? Come on, guys. Not eight miles. Bring it in. Bring it in. Bring it in. Bring it in. There you go. Ooh, I like that. I like that, uh... Shot spread. How's it look over here? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I like it. Let's see here. Okay, we got one out there. Seems like we spawned in a little bit earlier than a lot of people. Anybody seen uh, Sunscriber? I saw your your fact there about you know dinosaurs still roaming in the Earth. If uh, aliens were able to to kind of see Earth through a telescope, they might still see aliens or still see dinosaurs. Rather, anybody seen? Is the new Jurassic Park movie out yet? Or I, I don't even think it's Jurassic Park at this point. One of the the new Jurassic whatever movie. <laughs> I, uh, I liked the the first Jurassic Park, of course, but then I kind of fell off it once they started going with all this Jurassic World stuff and whatnot. June, oh, June 10th. Okay. I saw the uh, the review of it on, um, I don't remember what website, the BBC maybe or something like that, but uh, they, were, they were pretty enthusiastic about it. Hmm. Let's see. We're just going to keep hiding behind this, like, I don't even know, this Alcatraz Island right here. We're just going to, we're going to try and keep our heads down. We're just, we're, we're a fishing trolley. That's all that we're doing here. Here to, to fish, by golly. Oh wow, we got a hit. By golly. <laughs> Level one, you got 100% on the final? That's awesome. Had to flex on your friend? <laughs> I get it. Oh boy. That ship just Tokyo drifted into those rocks right there. That was impressive. Oh, we are way too far. There we go. Shooting at me, shooting back at me. I don't, I don't approve. Unfortunately, if you start hitting me, you're gonna, you're gonna do some damage. Cause I don't have, I don't even have the ability to do repairs. Yeah, and this fire. Oh no, if we're on fire. It's nearly over. We gotta get to B. <laughs> we, we gotta get some points. Oh, he's knocked out both of our front 
both of our front cannons at this point. That's no good. All right, who else can we see over here? Hmm. Oh, good. Well, the fire went out at least. That's something. He is severely underestimating how fast we are. That's good. We're gonna be fine. Explosions are temporary. Kudos to these guys. You know, we got like a couple guys just standing on the on the top there. They don't care. Ooh, we switched ammo types. Uh, torpedo, 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 torpedo. That front torpedo tube is not functional. We still got 14% crew. We're still we still got one functional turret. We gonna win. We gonna roll into B. We gonna hold this place. Uh, not if that guy keeps shooting me though. If that guy could stop shooting me, that would be great. And get the turret swung around. Uh, oh, nope, just lost that turret too. <laughs> Alright. This ship is barely functional. But we also don't have that much further to go. Oh no, not enough crew members for repair. Everybody stop shooting me until I get some points. Oh no. Uh, okay, good. None of the crew died on that one. That's nice. I think there's a way I can control the secondary guns there. We are sinking, that is correct. Select secondary weapons. We got we got backup guns. The gun is broken, not enough crew members. Come on, get in there. Get in there. <laughs> no. <laughs> Dang it. Oh man. <laughs> All right, we're gonna have to bring out the Fletcher. Gunners are searching for airborne and surface targets. Ooh, let's see here. Yeah, this one guy, yeah, still sitting right there like a champion, hiding behind some rocks. Love it. feel bad about going after that guy. We'll get there. It just might take me 25 minutes and at least one Tokyo Drift of a destroyer here. <sighs> no problem. Noel, good to see you. Have a great evening. Thanks for the gift. The gifted sub. Always appreciate the support. Let's see. Three and change over there. Hmm. I even want to just bring attention to myself. I don't even feel bad at this point. Yeah, we got a hit. I got rounds that can go through that thing. Here we go. The old kill assist, good. Yep, hiding, hiding back there like a champion. That's okay. I got you ranged, good sir. some damage doing some good things you can only hide back there for so long before before we're gonna come get you out of there I don't even feel bad about it to 
particularly when I swing my back guns around here and I'm able to get like a lot more fire on you. Come on now. Like precise. This is why they hide behind the rocks because there's such a small margin where you can hit them and not the rocks and not just go past them, you know? Not, not overshoot them, rather. The enemy ship sank. There we go. Revenge is a... I don't, know, I don't even know. Some people say it's a dish best served cold. <clears throat> I don't know about any of that. But I don't like it when you hit my ship like that. That's just rude. So we're gonna go over here, and we are gonna hide like champions. Perfect. There we go. <laughs> so you could eat lava? <laughs> it's it's back. The discussion continues. Who it is that's over there shooting at me, being rude. Oh, there he is. Good. Drawn his attention. <laughs> you see, see in their little turrets, just like boop. Uh oh. I'm in a an underpowered ship for this particular BR. That's all right. I ain't scared. just wiped out that smokestack though. A couple times. Oops. Sorry, I know that's disorienting. Oh ho ho ho! Yeah, we did, we did some damage right there. Yeah, it looks like he's repairing pretty well. Oop, all right. Well, probably broke off our propeller right there, but I'm not even sad about it. See? The, the tactical beaching is what we just did right there. Do we have out here? A little more effort and victory will be yours. Ah, yes. Hiding behind the rocks. Champions. As I hide behind the rocks. Make no mistake, this is, you know. This is. This is these are my kindred spirits. <laughs> oh, gotta kill us. Ship back so that it's floating. Oh boy. <laughs> I would. I <laughs> so the lava thing escalates. <laughs> if it fits in your mouth, it's edible. It just depends on if you will get consequences after eating. <laughs> 
I don't know. I don't know about that, guys. I think I think for it to be edible, it has to be you know fundamentally survivable. Uh oh. Let's hope. Let's hope. Oh, we might be stuck. Nope, we're good. We're good. We we we're like excavating that beach right there. Is what we're doing. This is great. Lava is better than chocolate water. <laughs> We're getting a crossing of the streams with the ridiculous conversations. <laughs> okay. Yeah, looks like all of our people are already pushing out. Looks like we've... Yeah, I mean, it's not over by any means. P-51? Dead on me, dead on me, dead on me. Oh boy. I saw him drop or launch something. Yeah, I heard one. There you go. <laughs> Edibles with or without deadly consequences is the distinction they need to be making. Yeah, I get it. <laughs> I would just like, you know, to point out that after complaining about people hiding behind the rocks all game, I have now left my rock fortress, okay? For the record. Yep. Oh, come on now. Every time I stop looking at this thing, my radar is like, there's somebody back there. <laughs> Unfortunately, I do not have access to lava um, that we can do some testing. Sorry. Sorry, everybody. So sorry. Woo! Rip open the hole on that one. That's all right. Oh. Hello there. Darkness, my old friend. Negative. Yeah, I thought that was way off. Oh, that ship's... It's capsizing. Oh, we got a hit. We gonna get a kill assist on that? We better. Bye, golly. Ooh, and another one. Oh, six... Six miles out, that's not gonna happen. Ugh. I tell you what, I'm probably gonna end up uh, ending after this one. I have just, I've had a headache today that I can't shake. I'm looking at the screen is making it a little bit worse to be honest. Oh boy, cannons. Cannons. He's moving. Oh boy. We cannot. All right, I'll go cap A. Goodness gracious, every. Oh! Yeah, that was three miles away. We just cranked some rounds over there. That was incredible. I got you. So what if I could get locked on? That's all right. I don't need the distance. I don't need the distance. Oh, we got him. <laughs> Thing is still moving. Thing died at speed. That was incredible. 
Okay. Yeah, five and change. Just yeet some rounds out there and we'll see what happens. Where are we getting shot from? Ah, yes, of course. Wow, that was some accurate fire, by golly. We are uh, listing rather severely. Oh my gosh, he just capsized us with that. That was incredible. Jeez. <laughs> Lava is from Minecraft, guys. It doesn't really exist. Whoop, taking out the Catalina. We're gonna go land on A. Although we're probably going to break off the wings on the way down to be, to be clear. Let's see if we can kind of put it into a slip here. Not bad. Wings are getting a little shaky. A little bit shaky. Note that one of our guys, a destroyer, is, is like spawn camping them on their side of the map rather than just capping A. I'm going to get it. I get it. Yeah, even Earth copied Minecraft. It's complicated. This is actually a fairly good rate of descent for us, given what it is that we're trying to do here. There we go. I got you. I got you, Billy. Well, I mean, I don't. You just keep drawing their fire and I'll go cap the point. So that'll work. Oh man, I should really get back to playing some Minecraft, actually. You guys talking about that? Um, Call Me Kevin is a YouTuber that I really enjoy watching his stuff. And he, he recently did like a zombie apocalypse mod basically like there was a like a never-ending like zombie horde that was out to get him basically <laughs> that was a lot of fun kind of mod that i'd be down for you basically just had to build like a fort and where are they where are the people who are going to shoot me when i land on this point Okay, this is a big point. All right. Keep the power up. We'll go right through this dinghy, which would be real bad for the plane. Keep there we go. Decapping. <laughs> if we are able to decap and then cap, that could be like the decider for the game here. Catalina coming through in the clutch. Ah, we could put the gear down. We could roll up right here on the beach. Hang on. We're gonna do it. Uh, yeah, gear down. Gear down. We're fine. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Give us a little bit more, a little more power. A little more power. Can we get up there? Are we sinking? Another zone Can we get <laughs> <laughs> oh, what happened? Oh, because I because I'm stuck. Because crash landing. That that was some shenanigans and tomfoolery right there. I don't know about any of that. I don't know about any of that. Oh man. Jeez. Yeah, microwave. I've done a Minecraft stream, but like for me, like I I'm just I'm so foreign to. Uh, to Minecraft that like Minecraft is harder for me to stream than something like War Thunder so on evenings when I'm like particularly tired or something I'm like nah I just I can't even trying to remember the names that they would have for things like I, I, I remember like I wanted to build like a crate to store all my stuff in and I could not come up with the right word for it and thankfully chat you know had my back there but it was you know it was 
box or something like that. I don't recall, but like I just didn't know the exact word, so I, I couldn't get to the point where I needed it. But uh, let's see. I mean, I feel like we need some bigger bombs. We definitely need some bigger bombs. Um, there we go. Airframe. We'll go compressor. That's how. That's how we do in the Catalina. Oh gosh. Yeah. Here we go. There we are. Yeah, alrighty everybody. I, I'm really sorry, but I'm not feeling particularly well. I'm uh, I'm gonna wrap up here. I think I've, uh, like I said, I've had uh, kind of a headache for a while, and at this point, I'm getting really quite hot. Which, you know, if you don't if you don't already um, like kind of pay attention to what you feel like as you start to get sick, um, it, it, kind of being in touch with like your own health. Um, is a is a really big thing, but uh, I know that like kind of an unexplained headache and then like me suddenly kind of getting particularly warm is an indication that you know I, I'm I'm something's wrong. So I I need to you know go hydrate and probably take a nice cold shower or something like that, just kind of get my body temperature down. But you know really paying attention to that sort of thing is like really important, particularly for pilots. Um, you have to be in tune with your body, you know and you can find accident reports where, you know, a pilot was like, well, I wasn't feeling that day, but I decided to go flying anyway. And then, of course, you know, they crashed and killed everybody. And so, you know, you know just just kind of being in tune with that sort of stuff is is uh, is important. So, um, OK, well, I appreciate everybody hanging out this evening. I apologize. It wasn't a little bit longer. And I am sorry that I uh, missed on Monday as well. But uh, I appreciate everybody being here. And of course, thanks for watching. <laughs>